What's going on, everyone? Welcome to Trading Crypto. Today we're going over Metis, M E T I S, down 3.1% at $23.40. 10 million max supply with only 4.3 million circulating. Super small max supply with a little under half in circulation. That's great. I love small circulating supply coins. Has a also has a small market cap of only 102 million. All time high on this was nine months ago at 323. All time low was one year ago at 345. If I'm not mistaken, this is a layer two that Vitalik's mom possibly created. I'm not sure if that's true or not. Post in the comments below if that is true. Um, currently available on the following exchanges down here. So with that, let's get into the price prediction and technical analysis on Metis. Okay, everyone, let's get into Metis. Metis right now has been consolidating at 23.59. You can see it's been acting as a very great support. Yes, it is resistance right now, but we do tend to break above it. If you look at the MACD, the MACD is bearish, but it's looking like it's about ready to curve up to a bullish crossover. Yes, we have not been moving largely on the bullish movement on the MACD, but bullish movement is bullish movement. If we just look at the RSI right here, it's flashed three buy signals so far on the 15th, on the 16th, and on the 19th. We're currently tailing back down, possibly reaching another low down there at 18. I personally think there's going to be better buying opportunities for this coin in the future. If we just look in the past and we add some extra support areas, it looks like there was a support back here and right here. So as of right now, I think if we do tail down below 236, the next stop's going to be around $21 or 21.15. If I draw a fib on this, we can try to dissect it just a little bit further for you. I think we're gonna draw a pretty decent size one right here. That's top to bottom right there. And, oh man, going crazy here on the fibs. And we're gonna draw it actually this way. Yeah, so as of right now, this resistance is something we really need to keep a close eye on, but I think we're going to be capitulating down to around 2185. Uh, definitely due to the volatility that I believe BTC is going to be go happening this week. If you don't, if you want to know what I'm talking about, click on my BTC video that I posted earlier today. So short term right now, I'm going to be bearish on this. I think we're going to be heading down to another oversold category. You can see no sell signals have flashed. A couple buy signals have flashed, and I think we're going to be tailing down to around $21 um, in the short term. So I'm not extremely bullish on this coin. I really don't know what it is or what it's about. I'm just doing a general TA video on it. Um, but as of right now, we've been in a downtrend since August of 2022, and we're still continuing that downtrend. I mean, we could draw a trend line and just see where we're at. Yeah. So similar to BTC, this support right here, support which is resistance right now, is getting very close to a crossover of this downtrend that you've been in since August. So eventually it's got to decide what it's going to do. If we go through this, it's not going to continue sideways. It's either to break to the upside to 28 or the downside. And the way that I think the market's going to be heading, I think we're just going to be consolidating right here until we capitulate down to around 22. I'm personally waiting for one more week to see what the market does because I think this next week is going to give us our answer. So with that, none of this is financial advice. And if there's any coins you'd like me to chart or if you just like the chat, make sure you join my Discord channel. You'll find the link below in the description. Find this content useful and you'd like to support the channel, head over to the Trading Crypto homepage where you can become a member. Click on the Join tab. It is $4.99 for a month. You get membership shoutouts, membership online chats, and priority replies and comments along with loyalty badges. Ooh.